I think when I was a kid, I really liked to work uh, with my hands. I liked to draw. Uh, I liked to make things myself. And uh, when I grow up a little bit older, I wanted to be an architect in the very beginning. And um, I love to work on specific and, and uh, touchable products. Actually, I'm working in a cycling business, and that's not without a reason. I really do love uh, sports, sports in general, and try to improve myself in, in daily life of sports. So that's running and cycling, and I used to do speed skating. Cyclists are crazy. At the moment, they are doing their job. They only have one goal, and they, they can just be in a tunnel vision and only focus on, on what they want to do. I think in general it's good that I know what cycling is because it makes it easier to think like they think or at least try to think how they think. My name is Ruben Broekhuizen, I'm product designer at Laser and I'm working right now already for two and a half years on the brand new TT helmet. Morning Clay. Good morning. How are you? How are you? Fine, fine. Let's go. I actually want to test with the suit as well. Did you think about the suit? Probably we get significant different results. And I was thinking the, um, the, the angle of the rider in front yeah. of the air. So I would start with the zero. First of all, making a TT helmet is something completely different than making a, a road helmet or an MTB helmet. The product, the shape of the product is created by, by the air. So in the wind tunnel, you just get your data uh, very fast and uh, we can directly uh, uh, use that in creating the best product possible. It's important to have those riders in the wind tunnel as well because we just see how they put the helmet on their head, how they position it, how they are in position and, and how the helmet is, uh, is, is behaving in that context. Since I was very young, I wanted to be a cyclist already. I uh, bought my first uh, race bike on Gio Comelli when I was uh, six or seven years old. My name is Ties Benoit and I'm a professional rider for Team Sunweb. I think material is, uh, uh, is based for uh, a cyclist. It's not like Formula One, but it's still a technical sport. For my helmet, for sure, the, the TT is the, yeah, the race where you, you can win with one second or you can lose with one second. And then uh, the, can, where you can really make a difference on the on technical uh, view. It's difficult to make it safe, but also like a, a cool and uh, a light helmet is something uh, really needs to be balanced really well and uh, I think uh, they found a good combination in these three uh, aspects. Yeah. I feel a lot of pressure to make helmets for, for these kind of riders. I think making helmets for, for, for pro riders is probably the most difficult thing to do. Yeah, I think that's a, a privilege.